Hello, my name is Andrew Nichols, and I'm the Clinical Perfusion Manager here at Leeds Teaching Hospitals Trust. I would like to offer my warmest heartfelt thank yous to the trustees of Morrison's Foundation for their generous gift in allowing us to buy this hybrid heart lung machine. Uh, both myself and our team, uh, clinical perfusionists, we are primarily responsible for keeping patients alive during heart surgery. And we do that by mainly using this tool, which is the heart lung bypass machine. Uh, it's a series of pumps, and together with what is an oxygenator and a reservoir, we are able to uh, divert all the blood away from the patient so that the heart can be isolated, so that we can replace parts or fix parts, patch up holes and things whilst keeping the patient safe and alive. Um, these are very good machines. They've, uh, they work using rollers that displace blood uh, around them. They are quite invasive though, and all the circuitry uh, has quite a negative effect on, on blood and uh, the inflammatory response. So when we thought of the idea of an, uh, a hybrid theater, uh, we wanted to come up with something slightly different rather than buying another heart-lung machine that we already have. And that's where the idea of a hybrid heart-lung machine came in. Um, and this is it here, and as you can see, it's got a much smaller footprint. And we're actually in the hybrid lab now, and whilst it looks quite empty because there's no patient in here, uh, the idea of a hybrid theatre is that you have two surgical teams, the, the, the surgical team and the interventional cardiology team. So with the two teams in here and all the equipment that we require to carry out a hybrid procedure, space becomes of a premium. So that's why cutting the footprint down became more important. As I touched on before, all this tubing and circuitry that we use is quite invasive. So by having it smaller, we can actually bring it even closer to the patient as well, reducing some of the length of that tubing. So the hybrid machine does everything that the normal heart-lung machine will do. Slightly smaller, but at the addition of a different sort of pump, and this is a centrifugal pump, and the veins in here are a lot less invasive than a roller. So it's better for a longer term support, um, making it a lot less damaging to, to uh, blood. In addition to that, we can use this in a different way to what we do with the, the heart-lung machine, which is for big open heart surgery. Uh, we can condense the circuit down and remove a lot of the elements, so it's there more as a a heart support device, which could be used temporarily during a hybrid procedure or for longer periods, perhaps post-operatively on intensive care if we needed to. The, uh, the application currently that we've been getting used to, because we've only really been using it for a few months now, has been the benefits of this particular pump for long procedures. Medium term, we're going to be looking at using it for smaller circuitry uh, so that we can we can offer benefits of removing a lot of the elements of the circuit and then longer term we're going to really start looking at the applications in hybrid procedures and the way cardiac surgery and cardiology is evolving often brings the two groups together and until we really recognize the true implications of this is when we can start recognizing the impact that this heart lung machine will have on behalf of myself my perfusion team and the wider lead congenital heart unit. And this has been uh, an incredible change in the way in which we perform hybrid procedures. Just wanted to say a huge thank you to the board at Morrison's for um, enabling us to deliver the heart and lung machine um, for our families. What a difference this machine is making already, as, as you know. Um, without organisations like Morrison's, we sim simply wouldn't be able to do the work that we do. So. We can't thank you enough. Um, I do recall the, the news coming in when we received the donation and um, we almost did a dance in the office, it has to be said. It was just fabulous news, massive impact for our families and for, for the heart unit in the work that they deliver. Your support is, is more than welcome and thank you.